adorned with snow during the winters, Alberta is arguably one of the most scenic provinces in all of Canada. Alberta is home to two of the oldest national parks in the world, and somehow managed to be incredibly inviting, and very accessible, despite its jagged, rugged and harshly beautiful terrain. The awe-inspiring glaciers and turquoise lakes of Banff, and Jasper National Parks draw millions of visitors each year to this province. Also, Alberta is one of Canada's most reasonable and affordable provinces to live in. To help you out, we made a list of top 10 best places to live in Alberta. Number 10 is Banff. The town of Banff is one of the most precious jewels in all of Canada. Full of mountain views, crystalline lakes, and wildlife, it's not surprising that this park and surrounding sites are at the top of almost every must-visit list. Located 130 kilometers west of Calgary, Banff National Park is the most visited tourist attraction in the province of Alberta, and perhaps the most impressive national park in Canada. Authentic saloons with mechanical bull riding are A-plus for visitors, looking for a taste of the local culture, as are the many farm-fresh restaurants and cool shops downtown. While in town make sure to get outside. Take the gondola for stunning views of the city, or ice skate at Banff Community High School rink downtown. One of the most photographed places in all of Canada is the iconic Moraine Lake, with its ten peaks reflecting on the glistening, mirror-like water. So there is no doubt almost all visitors to Banff, make an effort to see the place with their own two eyes. Number 9 is Jasper. Jasper is one of the best places to live in Alberta, surrounded by the mountains, it's a place where you can bike, climb, camp, fish or hike in summer and ski, board, snowshoe and dog sled in winter. If you ever wondered what nature showing off looks like, then come to Jasper National Park and you'll soon find out. Deep canyons sliced by roaring waterfalls, jade-colored forests, frosty mountain peaks and emerald lakes, Jasper National Park is nature untamed and quite the showstopper. It is the biggest national park in Canada. In Jasper, there's no such thing as tourists. People who come here are adventurers and explorers, novices and experts. Number 8 is Strathcona County. Strathcona County is located in central Alberta, Canada between Edmonton and Elk Island National Park. Strathcona County is perfect for those who enjoy the fine balance of rural and urban territory. For this reason, the area of Strathcona County is a specialized municipality, as it does a fine job of supporting the needs of those living in the rural area of the city, as well as those who live in the urban portion of the city. Strathcona County is home to two public airports. Cooking Lake Airport is the county's main public airport, serving 87% of its public aeronautical transportation needs. In a city where the crime rate and the unemployment rate is low, there is no doubt that it is one of the best places to live in Alberta, and Canada as well. Number 7 is Lloydminster. The city of Lloydminster traverses the border between Saskatchewan and Alberta. It is Canada's sole border city, with the provincial border running through the center, creating a unique living experience for its residents. Lloydminster is a vibrant community, that is experiencing significant growth. The city offers a rural environment, with the convenience of urban services and amenities. The Lloydminster Golf and Curling Center, is an all-year-round sporting facility, which is operated by the city of Lloydminster. Get in touch with the wild side, by visiting the Border City Petting Zoo in Lloydminster. It is only a 5-minute drive, which is east of Lloydminster. Bud Miller All Seasons Park, Lloydminster Cultural and Science Center, RCMP Hope Monument and Sandy Beach Regional Park, are the other popular attractions in Lloydminster. Number 6 is Edmonton. Edmonton, the capital of Alberta, stretches along both banks of the North Saskatchewan River, in roughly the center of the province. With a trendy downtown area, that's guaranteed to give you that much needed fix, of good old-fashioned Canadian city fun. A trip to Edmonton is one, that definitely needs to be on your travel plans. With that economic prosperity, Edmonton has invested in art and culture, by building excellent theaters and museums. The city's greatest claim to fame, however, is the West Edmonton Mall, which is one of the largest leisure, and shopping centers in the world. 
Edmonton is said to be one of the most affordable cities in Canada, where you can buy a home at a much lower price than in other major cities. Due to the abundance of natural gas in Alberta, the heating cost is lower, not to mention fuel. People here also enjoy a lower tax rate and free basic health care. Number 5 is Camrose. The city of Camrose is located in central Alberta, amid the rich farmlands of the prairies. It is a very small town, one of the smallest on this list, but it has more than enough for you to take part in, as well as over 35 secondary schools for your children to attend. There is plenty of unique dining, and shopping areas in this town. It developed as a small city along the railroad, but has since switched to develop along Highway 13. Camrose has a lovely environment, for outdoor activities and scenic landscape. It is often referred to as the Rose City because of the large number of wild roses, that grow in the parklands. With the advent of the Big Valley Jamboree in Camrose, it has become even more oriented towards tourism and hospitality. Number 4 is Medicine Hat. Medicine Hat is known as the oasis of the prairies and Canada's sunniest city, boasting an average of 330 days of sunshine per year. It is the sixth largest city in the province, is known for its natural gas fields. Its summer festivals, and urban parks make it a place to stay, or to plan your adventures around southeastern Alberta. Medicine Hat gives you a boutique city feel, with its growing population of just over 81,000 people. Medicine Hat experiences the lowest combined tax rate in Canada, the lowest utility rates in Alberta, and a relatively mild climate year-round. Number 3 is St. Albert. Located northwest of Edmonton, St. Albert is the fifth largest city in Alberta. Founded by Father Albert Lacombe in 1861, St. Albert is rich in history and culture. It is a wonderful place to plan a visit, and a definite detour you should make, if you're in the Edmonton area. Although it has a lively arts scene, it's also home to one of the largest outdoor farmers markets in Canada, which is actually the largest in Western Canada, bringing in up to 15,000 visitors every Saturday in the summer. Situated on the Sturgeon Riverbed, this Albertian city has natural areas interspersed along beautiful hiking trails that winds its way through the city. Number 2 is Canmore. Canmore is an old mining town in Alberta, Canada. Nestled in the Rockies, this beautiful place offers a chance to connect with nature. This city is located 50 miles west of Calgary, and borders Banff National Park. The town, offers an outdoor lifestyle, with picturesque scenery. It is a perfect place to start a family, because of the available social amenities, and the friendly environment. The cost of property in the town is rising significantly, as property investors rush to meet the demand for real estate. Cross Sea Ranch, Wildlife Distillery, Avon's Gallery, Kananaskis Wildlife Drive, Grotto Canyon, and Ha Ling Peak, are some of the popular attractions in Canmore. Number 1 is Calgary. According to the report, Calgary is not only the best place to live in Alberta, but also one of the best places to live in the world. With a population of over 1.4 million residents, Calgary is the fourth largest city in Canada, a feature that attracts more people including immigrants. Unemployment is slightly higher in Calgary at 7.9%. Still, the median household income outranks the other two cities on this list, Vancouver and Toronto, at $98,309 so there are opportunities to earn a higher wage. Calgary has a dynamic job market, that employs the population. It is a vibrant modern city, which takes particular pride in its cowboy roots. The Calgary Tower, is one of the prime tourist attractions in Calgary. Standing tall on the city skyline, the tower offers the highest 360-degree observation deck in the world. Annual events like the Calgary Stampede, bring people from all over the world to the city, to enjoy the rodeo, exhibition, and festival. Thanks for watching this video, please like, share and subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell, bye for now.